refugees, refugees. Um, we're gonna continue our game on. This is Andreas, and uh, we're currently on the rebound from losing our leader, Nesta, when we accidentally euthanized him. Um, trying to switch characters and uh, you button mash don't you that uh, you know to, to collect to change your players you get used to a quick sequence of buttons and I can actually do it without looking I don't look at my hands of course like no one I don't imagine anyone does when they're playing you don't have to look at your controller when you're playing and I sort of like looked up in the top corner of the TV at the things and then quickly changed the camera and the next thing I changed the uh, character, she does say. And the next thing, she was stepping back and she says, well, you're going to have to go. <laughs> she drew back the uh, the top sh slider on her, right, on her pistol, pointed it at Nesta, the leader. There was nothing wrong with him, really. It was only, he only had a, what you could have cured with three, like this guy. Look what he's got wrong with him, nothing. You could cure it with a, you know, three, three blood blood samples. Like he's gonna do now. And she just drew back the cock on the gun and killed him. Uh, no, <laughs> nothing I could do about it. I can't get to the Xbox to turn it off. As some people say you can turn an Xbox off quick enough. You can save your character's life if you if you realise you've accidentally got him killed. So now he's better, you see. It just cost us three blood plague uh, samples, and that gave us 17 influence too. So he was due to come back and now the thing is I haven't got a warlord but now I have got a warlord again. So I found this guy, went and saved him. He's literally got the same stats as Nesta but he looks like Tyler. Um, Messi, you know exactly where, where everything was, if you'd uh, quick clean it up. That's the thing what he says. I have the same set of approach actually. My office and my um, main living area where I live it looks messy to everybody else, but it's not really messy. Um, it's just I've got a lot on, that's all I say. I've got a lot on. And if you tried to put it all away, I'd only have it all out again. You know, so. Machine shop, get some more um, machine parts going. So, with the person who shot me, who was it? It was, um, this is Nick, he's only a citizen, so he's got to get, I've got to build his, everything up. Tanya, Tanya shot me. Um, Anyway, so uh we've got an issue over here. Can you come help us out? Wanna switch to yeah. on. She's got blood plague. It's not really bad at the moment, so um but what I was thinking I could do um we do need to create some more pills. Um, there's something else that we can do, and I just can't remember what it is. Yep, the casket. Let me put the casket in. Installed in the infirmary. Kit allows mana pass passive recovery from injuries for inactive characters only. There, there is something else that I had as well, I just can't remember what it is. So I'd have to leave her behind, so she's uh, inactive. I will go and find so somebody else. Tired. Put all these pills. It's only got one damage on a um, melee weapon. So just to add more things, she needs um, crackers. Uh, 
and she needs um Oh, what else? Coffee. Well, we've only got one or two coffees, so we won't be doing that. Let's just change out. Hey. Break time. For me, anyway. You're up. She's got quite good health. She needs a cardio up as well, anyway, so. Um. She's got pills, sandwiches, coffee, crackers, a gun, and a weapon. She's only got two damage. Yes. You're the boss. Yes, I am. Right, so I'll be using this guy for most of the time, as much as I can. We have to bring some more um, parts. Uh, sorry. Uh, oh, materials in. Maybe bring some more meds in and some more fuel, I'm not sure. Let's have a look. There's your meds. Yeah, that'll do. Okay, so what we've got on is... Promote a community lens leader and moon channers. The only cure. Well, I suppose we could help him. This is the only thing we've got on at the moment. Oops. Boom. We'll just take one. Have we got any fuel? I don't think she has any. We don't have any in the back. Um. Hmm? Right behind you. I should do it. We'll drive. Grab him over. I just wish he wouldn't go in the back, that's so. all. Screamer, how fantastic. So this should be, like I said, day 16 night shift. Because obviously we're going through the night, we've got a starry night. Oops. I was wanting to look. You think one of you folks could help us out over here? The fight. Oh, hey. What's happening? You're the boss. Yes, I am. Opportunity to maybe go and trade that item or two as well. Um, we've got this Jeep, so we don't often. Together, all 
also means respecting the needs of everyone in your community. There's nothing more frustrating than the feeling you're being ignored. Who said that? <laughs> Anything more frustrating than what? Let's just ignore that statement. Good to see you alive, buddy. Come in. Beat you to it. Right. Speak with Kirsten. Orange jacket. Sorry, buddy, a little busy. You're not. You might be okay after all. Stay Cheeky alive, bitch. all right? Tell you what. You can buy this crap off me. Hey, you're not dead. I think we can help each other out. Might as well. And now, which would they want for it if they had one and they were selling it back to me? Hey, yo! Got anything useful you're looking to unload? Cool. Sounds good. They want 336 for it. It's not bad, I suppose. I don't know, I just didn't want it. Uh, That's got uh, air fuel in it. There's plenty of fuel in that. Um, I suppose as an emergency measure, I could leave fuel in there. Huh? After you. But I, I don't think I can access, there, even though they're allied. To star for them, you know? I still cannot access my locker from their their point, which is what I used to be able to do. So whether it was a glitch or not, and they've sealed it up, I just thought it was a regular thing that if you've got an ally, they give you access to your locker. This is how it happened for me. When I was at, um, uh, Mega Valley, I think it was, and um, no, I think it's the hills. No, it was Mega Valley. I'm sure it was. And um, there's a there's like a campsite called oh Quint oh, gone well past it. If anyone out there can hear this, I wouldn't mind an assist. Something like Oh my god. Lose my other 
guy. I just I only wanted to go to a truck and I saw that house I thought ooh, opportunity just to go in there and get my uh, my truck back. Then I saw the flashing things where is it? Oh, yeah. Somebody in here. What's up? Hi. It's Anna. I'm looking to do some trading. Why not? Don't need any of the stuff you've got. We've already had this place to bits. But the thing where they say all the stuff never comes back, it runs out and all the rest of it, I think that's a bit stupid because um, for a start, other people could have been there, like Anna's been there, she could maybe think, oh I'm coming back here so and hopefully, hopefully nobody else comes back. So I'm going to stash some stuff where I can quickly get to it. Nice. Stay back, but it will do. It's funny. I'm glad they gave us that ability to do that. I mean, obviously, you can't always have realistic playthroughs because things don't always go realistically, do they? You know, the realistic. I see trouble. Let's just keep our distance. Friends did as well. She was ugly. I feel like passing out. Well, if I want to use him tomorrow during the day when I can see stuff, he's absolutely tired out, isn't he? So I'm going to have to go and give him a rest. And um, he is ready to go. Yes. After you. Yes. Just Don't get dead. It. Okay. Don't get dead. Grass, you're still alive. Hey, I can't do everything myself. That sort of thing when you're in the air the is when it, it takes. There's a group the of arms dealers nearby. The prices are high, but the selection is huge. Maybe we should check it out. Sounds like an opportunity. You're the boss.
coffee, bed bats, everything. Yeah, she's okay. And uh, watch your goddamn targets. The weapon doesn't have a, sn a, s uh, a scope on it. Never mind. Maybe I should get started on that. Nick's personal goal, investigate a group of arms dealers. Take control of Nick. All right, I've just let Nick go, I know. It's, um, it's got a backup buddy. All the way down there for that, no thanks. I got this one. He's just up the road, we're doing that. Whoops. Not really concerned with points anymore now. Since it's basically game over. All I have to do is get Nick up to scratch. Hey, over here. Make him the leader. He's too tired. But yeah, happy to see you then. Uh, Latanya. Abandoned my old place, Red Stone Shed. Commander's net. And there's a lot of them guns about, rare guns. Sure. Yay. First, we're going to look in there's here. There's a buttload of zombies heading our way, but we're ready for them. After you. I'm going to need a lighter load soon. Every time I make a noise. That's our execute, right? <laughs> no. All your friends are dead. I know you are dead. If I can't use it, maybe someone else can. I'm tired of carrying this already. Quite a lot of stuff in here, actually. But my argument is that should produce fuel, of course, and it should be one can because it's one can. There's nothing to say. It's just the. Are you making any progress on that little task? What the heck is he doing? Looking inside the. If only every fight was that easy. The infestations are getting out of hand. Time to fix that. I'm gonna need a yeah. lighter load soon. When Nesta's feeling... when... Nesta... When the new guy, Nick, is feeling better and rested... I just wanted to check now there's nothing else, cos I... Scarface there. <coughs> I think that's everything. There was quite a lot in there though, aren't they? Especially 
whole bags of stuff. She wants to be up there. We'll just do this in one go, really. Normally, what I can do is take her over there. Look, a freak. How nice. Actually, we're not quite positioned right correctly. I have been here before actually because I remember the pond. I'm really not a fan of this place. Yeah, welcome to the apocalypse. I wish we could improve torches, you know, have a torch upgrade. So you could come in and say, right, okay then, we've got somebody with a big battery. It was just going to help us, you know, you maybe have three of you. Put more zombies on, certainly. Make it more dangerous, because this is a little bit on the easy side, isn't it? Premises are empty. That's what I like. There's nothing in there, though. That's not what I like. A little bit of action. <laughs> remember, I don't know if you saw a video, maybe five or six videos ago now, I stood and looked at that game, it's called, I think I remember what it's called, I can't know, it's about like a game of Frogger or something, no, pigs, yeah that's it, Pokey, like a fan pig thing game, watch, Peddler's Barbecue, that's right, I remember it. Uh, oops, problem. <laughs> so just break the window there, see if anybody comes out. And they should, but... I was wondering if um, it huh? would be a good idea After you. maybe just to have like occasionally you'll have people into the place who maybe live there you accidentally give them a sh shot across the bounds Latandre Legendary I've got no fuel but I'm not far from base Finally Wow, there it is. <laughs> this is that American car. In my other game it was black. This is the car I've been telling you about. That is like, it's the American muscle car. So I want to note this video. And I'll maybe call it New American Muscle Car, but the point being is that I've been talking to about three different people and they said there's only one American Muscle Car and that's called the Maximilian and I said no there's another one and I couldn't remember what the name was. Repair kit needed. Not fuel or anything. Look. It's not as fast as the max.
four spaces in the boots as opposed to this um, which I suppose depending on how much space I have in my base 27 and it's 25, 25 so if I put um, one ammo in Got to 17, so I don't want to put the other ammo in. Yeah. Pack this piece of shit across the doorway. You do hey. know that all this noise is going to literally wake the dead, right? Yep. Yeah. Look at her cardio. Yes. All right, lead the way. And look at her cardio. She's got nothing, so I'm going to run with her. In both senses of the uh, the phrase, I'm going to run with this character. Bit of sprinting here and there doesn't do anybody any harm. Should get her cardio, no harm. And <laughs> We're supposed to do. Fine. The situation maybe isn't the rotten bastards wouldn't let me kill. Me. So fucking tired. Day seventeen. You've just seen it come up on the calendar there. So we are 33 minutes into that video. So we've got about 15 minutes left. Just, I want to go and just get this woman in. A little, a little bit of cardio. Quite a long way to run to go back to my vehicle. Now I've just put a waypoint on the other vehicle. Which is there. We might actually run to there first, do that mission, then run up to the vehicle. So we can see in the distance that it is a hundred and ninety meters away. Let's let's say we'll go just ten meters away from it. Two hundred. Four, three, two, one. We're 200 meters away. If you've got a clock with a second hand, time this in uh, five, four, three. Floaters, the skunks two, of the Zed world. One. We get running. Just normal jogging spe speed. Most direct line we can. I'll just give a little sprint just to make up for that little bit of wasted time there. That was just a quick sprint. So we're looking just to see how long it takes us to get there. Not the fastest. If we um, if we're unheeded. Is that 35 seconds? Taking into account the odd fence, of course, as well, which will slow down by a five seconds ish. Right, we're there now, so that's about, you know, a minute. Two, well, so you can say roughly about 100, m 100 meters will take you about a minute 
Where's the door? Did not. Oh, there it is. Let's see if we can search this place quickly, okay? I might actually need the car. This might be useful. Emphasis on might. That's handy. This will slow me down. You know that. We'll search everything first. I'd say this was a sign. If, you know, I believed in that stuff. Hey, I found it. Fucking A. Yeah, I found it. You're not having it. Don't want that one yet. Ah, there it is. Mm hmm So we're going to just clear this place first and then she can have a gun. Um, that's heavy. And uh, do me for now. Ah, uh, nope. We still got company. I can handle. Would it have killed you to be more friendly? Whatever. We're out of here. <sighs> uh, I think the cooking book was the most important thing there. She's not really strong enough to carry that big hefty weapon you see, so it's tiring her out, but I suppose it's also giving her the um the impetus you know one two pounds one one uh. Thank you. Give me some. You guys look like you know what you're doing. 
I respect that. But she's got a space a space that we could use. So yeah, why the not? beginning of a beautiful friendship. Come on. Um, let me show you your new home. Base wise, we've got um two of these. We don't need one of them. I'm gonna need a lighter load soon. Waste of time. We're just picking up all the bits we can pick up. Just for the hell of it. It was only that one then. I'm sure I can make it back to the uh, base. Screamer quiet. How fun has that megaphone? Nine on the meds. Uh, have we got fuel in there? I haven't got any fuel in there, so... No, that's okay. So we don't want any of that. And that can go in there. And change over to Yes. Yes. You're the boss. Snidia, whatever it is, my name. She doesn't need that, 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 or that. Reposition that, that. Right, well, we've got three people with us.
Zed's coming in, all sides. Cabin pack motel. I've never seen that, you see. Anyone out there? I need some help. So I want to go back here, get that. We'll go that way first and go and sort him out. And then we'll go and have a look at the park. Um, we need fuel in the vehicle. No, 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 get out. Stupid woman. And when we go back down here... Eh, so why should put some fuel outside? If I have to go in there, I lose, I lose my support. Get damn fuel in the vehicle, please. Right. Anyway, that is basically the end of the night shift, I think. So we're going to call it quits there, 47 minutes, um, and we're going to go into the 17th day. So I suppose we will maybe just take her in there. I don't know. Uh, let's just stand here. We're, we've got safety because we've got the we've got the main guys. She can stand up on there. If anybody comes, these two can defend themselves. I can't while I'm stood while I'm changing my title and my video and everything else. Shooting goes up. Right, anyway. You notice there's then as well that my trigger went off twice, although I pressed it once. That's that very sensitive high for sensitivity I've seen to have, have got on my weapon for some reason. Trigger. Anyway, thank you very much for watching. Please look People in the description. Why is free of zombies. But that don't matter to me. Oh, you up for a swim? I say go for it. <laughs> that place was crowded before. How bad you think it is now? Yeah, definitely. Um, How did a bunch of hippies like the network survive the zombie apocalypse? <sighs> Fuji's. So, um, yeah, so look in the video description for any notes and uh, links I've maybe put in there. Um, apart from that, thanks for watching. Please support my videos with any likes, subscribe, follows that you can do. It all helps and... Uh, I appreciate it. Thank you very much. I'll catch you in the next video.